can add files, you can add pictures, you can post videos, you can post uh, uh, voice notes, you can post anything. I'm going to do this again. Add file, select file, okay, open file, choose a participant or a group. And you simply edit. And that person or that group will receive an email notification. Okay, to tell them, okay, Mr. Rod added something in the blog. Okay, so here it is. So my one added a file just now. Okay, it's about this. You can download it, you can view it, or you can share it with other people. You can also add links from the web. Okay, the same thing. You simply copy the URL, okay, here, okay, the name, the title of that website, the web link, additional information about the link, you choose the group or specific people, and you add them. You can also, okay, make conference call, virtual meeting. This is what's beautiful about this, uh, this uh, toolkit. Virtual meeting. It's like uh, I opened here. Uh, I'm going to start from the beginning. I'm going to show. What do you mean by virtual meeting? Virtual meeting. You can invite people to if you have a lesson or a presentation. So if they are online, so uh, you, they 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 can they can join you in this platform. They can see your pre your presentation. You can also discuss, you can chat. Yeah, I'm going to show this into scenes, believe me, I said this uh, yesterday. So virtual meeting, you write the name of uh, the meeting, for example. So for example, let's say, let's just do a presentation or something like this. You choose participants. Okay, for example, let's say, this is participant. You create, okay? Then you start your virtual meeting. This is good for online classes, okay? So here you should, uh, should have already prepared a presentation, a PowerPoint presentation, okay? And you should save it in your desktop and upload it so that the participants can save it. Okay? So we'll share. For example, you import your presentation. Okay? I'm just importing the other two slide presentations because it doesn't take too much time. So let's say Geo open you can prepare a lesson uh, a presentation about a paper about a given topic or anything you want to share with the participants so you will be the speaker and the others are the participants okay so when you upload your presentation the participants can see your presentation on the on the screen or your lesson Okay, so here we have one participant, because I invited just myself. You can invite a group, you can invite a class, you can invite just... So, uh, then, so this, this, uh, this uh, PowerPoint presentation consists of two slides, you can move from one slide to another. You can talk, you can speak, okay? You can use this uh, toolbar. toolbar, for example, if you want to highlight a word, Simply, okay, just use the, or you want to, okay, there are nice tools here to be used, okay, while presenting your paper or teaching a lesson. So, uh, participants, you can see, they can see you online. You can also see the participants. They can chat here, they can ask questions, okay? And uh, you can also write something on the 
this uh, white blackboard. Okay, so you need headphones and a mic. The participants also need headphones and mics so that they can hear you and they can also talk to you. Okay, going to go back again to this. So uh, you can also send uh, text messages, email messages, voice notes, and video notes. You can send a voice notes, voice notes for example, okay, message to the group, okay. So you simply record, okay, record your voice. You record your message, and then you choose the participants or the groups, and then you you send them, okay. You can also send a, a video, a video notes. Okay. So uh, here you record his notes. So uh, yes, you record it. For example, I'm recording myself because I think the automatic is uh, functioning, so it's not work now. It's a free toolkit, so it's easy, easy to work with and coordinate groups. For example, who can use it? We have a group of teachers. They have projects. You can use this. Okay. So you can use it to share and manage files, as I said, to manage a group calendar, to pull your group post links, to set up conference calls, make virtual meetings, online classes, okay, and so on. Do you have any questions about this web tool before I move to the next one? Mm -hmm. So, um, second one is uh, called the uh, 